Six days after the last chase, I found myself chasing in the same portion of southeast Nebraska again. A couple of tornado worn supercells were moving north out of Kansas into southern Nebraska. I'm coming up to the eastern one now. It had what looked like a decent wall cloud underneath it. There were some pointy lowerings underneath, but I didn't think these were funnels or that it produced any tornadoes. There's not much here in the way of rotation, and it seemed as soon as I got underneath this feature it started to fall apart. You can see some neat little cumulus getting kicked up here and being sculpted by some strong winds. With this first supercell quickly dying, the next one off to the west was still going strong and tornado worn, so I went after it. It was getting dark here, but this storm had amazing amounts of lightning. In time lapse here, it looks like a strobe light, and the camera's not even picking up all the flashes. There was so much lightning that there was just a continuous rolling thunder. This was only the second time I had heard that while chasing, and it was still very impressive. The storm had transitioned into a high precipitation supercell. You can see what used to be a wall cloud here fanning out into a big gust front. The northern end of it still looked like it could easily produce a tornado, and it was moving right over Beatrice, Nebraska at this time. Luckily it didn't produce.